Greetings, Spartan. I'm Roland, UNSC Infinity's AI. We're going to study the historical battles in hopes of increasing your tactical skills for the future. As a bonus, it's a pretty fun game you can play in your spare time. So let's get to it. Loading up records for the Battle of Drathius V. The fighting started when a splinter sect of Covenant ignored the ceasefire of 2552 and attacked UNSC forces. By the time the fighting was done, well, it didn't end well for the UNSC or the Covenant. Either one. Spartans Davis and Palmer were both stationed on Drathius V's moon at the time of the first attack. Let's see how they succeeded in repelling the first assault waves. As Spartan Davis continued fighting on the moon, Spartan Palmer and a handful of UNSC troops redeployed to the surface of Drathius V to fend off the invaders there. Outmanned? Outgunned? Spartan Palmer didn't see it as a problem. How about you? Even though the battle was going in the Spartans' favor, Drathius V had a surprise in store. Its moon wasn't a moon at all. It was a forerunner creation designed to build and destroy entire planets. Nobody knew about this until the Covenant cult leader found a way to reactivate the old forerunner tech and start disassembling Drathius V. It was Spartan Davis's job to shut down the device. Although Spartan Davis deactivated the device, Drathius V wasn't quite the safe and secure planet it used to be. Suddenly, Spartan Palmer wasn't just fighting off hordes of Covenant, she was heading an evacuation. With so many UNSC craft destroyed by the initial attack, she needed to find an alternate way to get everyone off world. Spartan Davis sacrificed himself to save many lives on Drathius V. Although the Covenant forces were broken, the UNSC command wanted the Covenant leader, Merg Vol, eliminated. Spartan Palmer was tasked with returning to the moon to finish the job. After she managed to eliminate Merg Vol and avenge Spartan Davis, Spartan Palmer successfully sabotaged the Forerunner device, eliminating the threat once and for all. Good work, Spartan. You completed the full cycle of Drathius V battle records. That's it. History lesson over. Now get out of here and go train in the war games with the other Spartans. I'll see you around. So. I killed Merg Vol and we all went home. Is that the official version these days? <laughs> you ought to see what came next. Oh, Sarah Palmer, you are so awesome. Operation Hydra. All right, so this is a extra mission they added on. All right, Battle at the Arid Sea. And some of that artwork you saw and some of the... It, it, I know it looks like concept art, but actually some of this art is very similar to what's in the comic, uh, Escalation comic, um, especially the covers. The covers have that style of art on them, which is really cool. All right, we got the Magnum and the Shoddy. Let's do it. We got to see her face, but not Master Chief's. Yeah, um, Master Chief, I think the illusion there is that they want the gamer who plays as... John, you know, uh, 117, to feel like they might be John, even though they may, they defined him as a male. So it's like, I know some females that play the Halo, they're like, you know, they can't really connect in that way. But I think that's kind of the, the point of him is that they wanted to kind of keep him ambiguous. Um, so that way there would be some level of, uh, you know, for fans to go, oh, I could be John, Lo you know, John, not John Locke. <laughs> that's uh, that's lost. Um, and Spartan Locke is a different character. But yeah, that's what I, I think. That's I mean, that's just my theory on it. So 
sweet. All right, we got a minute and 36 seconds. We can do it. We can clear out those enemies. Two enemies left. Shit, this guy is no joke. Oof. He was pissed. Come on, where are you? Where are you? Oh shit! It's a effing wraith! Oops. Ow. Nice! Woo! Luckily, luckily that grenade was there. Holy cow. And I can still smell these detox pads at the bottom of my feet. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, do we, oh, this is the new tank. This is that new shit. This is the one that fires twice. I like this one. Got a lot of health left. So look out for the soup. The little bombers. Oh shit. Alright, we gotta get out of this thing. Oh my god, we're almost dead. Damn. We are so outnumbered here. Wait, what's all back here? Grenades? Yay! Oh shit. Ow. Give me that needler. Nice. Alright. Then the engineer and clear the area. Wait, where's the engineer? Has he is he dying? Is he back here dying? Oh no, he's here. Okay. Okay, defend the engineer while he hacks the console. Oh, thank God we only have to we only have to cover his ass for 15 seconds. God, that seems way too easy, right? <laughs> What's gonna go wrong? Oh, they're gonna come in from with jetpacks and just chuck chuck grenades at us. Holy hell! Hold out until the light bridge is activated. Fuck you, you hold out. <laughs> Alright, let's uh let's pick up as much ammo and grenades as we can. Oh shit! All right, we gotta we gotta cross this bridge, even though hell's coming towards us. Oh, I don't want to move across this bridge. Whew, did it! Yeah. How many grenades I have left? One? All right. Come on, light bridge. Oh, we made it. Yes. You mad, bro? All right. Oh, we got a shoddy? Ooh. Die. Um, I, I'll buy one. I'll try it, but I don't know how. I've never streamed or posted or made videos. Uh, I'll tell you right now. I make um, my YouTube videos. I, f I film on my phone, actually. And I gotta say, I think they're pretty good quality uh, for being f recorded on my phone. But 
if someone ever critiqued me and said, hey, I, I don't like the quality of your videos, I, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't be mad at them because I'd be like, oh, okay, ma maybe. Shit. Um, also, you heard, uh, because we had that cutscene uh, that showed it, but uh, Davis is dead. Our Spartan Davis, the guy who was like kind of our ally and partner in this in this level, which is a, a bummer because he he was very helpful and uh, and pretty and pretty badass. Oh, here's some grenades. There we go. No, seek wrong way. I'm like right next to oh shit 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 Oof find the door to the shrine all right, let's get the hell out of the hutch Shit. Oh, I thought I was dead. I thought I was dead. Get in. Get in, engineer. All right, enter the shrine. Oof. We freaking did it. Uh, all right, last level. Let's read the thing here. The source. Engineering equipment became increasingly unreliable while moving further into the cistern. Uh, the, f <laughs> the forerunner signal... In interfered with anything capable of picking it up. Engineering worked frantically to keep their equipment in running order, yet Spartan Palmer's Mjolnir armor was able to withstand the interference. Palmer was able to follow the signal deeper into the caves, eventually to its very source. As she got closer, the Forerunner code rippled across her sensors, translating before her very eyes. Palmer, it said, help me. That was when the mission changed then from exploration to extraction. Oh shit. Final mission. Here we go. Reclaim Spartan Davis's remain. Oh shit. That's who's whispering to us, huh? Spartan Davis somehow? Oh my god. These light bridges are actually pretty cool. Um, if you're a Mega, uh, Mega Bloks fan, they make them in Mega Bloks form. I have two little light bridges, which are, they look pretty dope, actually. All right. You All right, we got one. Cool. Why are these guys giving me such a hard time? Shit. Oh, thank God for that shield. Running, 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 running. Shit, shit. Oof. Three seconds. All right, we almost made it. Attach Davis's remains to the pelican. What the? F what are you talking about? Shit. Do it? Are we alive? Did we beat the game? <laughs> we did it. Archaeology achievement. The transmission was Davis's call for help just before he died. That planet was made to build things out of galactic material, and it tried to build something out of what was left of Davis. I shut it down. 
Spartan Davis was my friend, and a damn good soldier. He deserves better than to be wiped out of our training records. Thank you guys so much. Uh, I will have uh, I will have a good night, <laughs> and I hope you have a good night too. I don't know where I was going with that. I, I totally zoned out. Um, I need some sleep, but I need to edit first. So you guys have a good night. Bye.